video and today I'm going to be organizing my um, hygiene shelf in my closet um, this is something that I've been planning on doing for a while because my hygiene I gotta say I guess collection I, I've kind of been accumulating a lot of products because I've become girly in that way like I like a whole bunch of like body washes body scrubs like that's just my thing right now so i have a ton of different things in there and i just wanted to go ahead and organize it because it's looking a little cluttered at this point um i got a couple bins from um dollar tree and um i honestly feel like i need some more but we're gonna see um how this organize how what i got organized and everything i got two big bins and two smaller bins and then i have um some labels for the bins so yeah so let me go ahead and show you guys this shelf that i'm talking about so this is my hygiene shelf that bin up there is like cluttered with a whole bunch of hair stuff and all that so that doesn't really count as hygiene it's just like hair stuff but like this is my real like hygiene shelf i have two skincare systems right here because the company sent me one and sent me one again a later time i got like um a whole bunch of like face stuff in here body it's really just a mix of everything in here it was supposed to be just like face stuff but it's turned into body washes face mask a body scrub is right there then these are all like body washes and i even have like this aztec mask this hair mask um a whole bunch of body scrubs it's just like it needs to be organized you feel me so that i'm like i can see everything or at least know where everything is because right now everything is just like jumbled up and so yeah all right guys so i brought everything out of the closet except for the skincare system because like it's gonna be how it is in there just you know laid out like that um so now i'm about to make um each of these a purpose so i'm going to i have a feeling that i'm gonna put skincare like face care products in like a smaller bin because i like to stick to my basic same things when i do my face so i don't really feel like it needs like a huge bin because it's not really gonna grow that much compared to my body care items so i'm just going to put um maybe these masks in here like that and just like kind of try to organize it like that, so.
I'm just gonna go ahead and make labels for each um, each box instead of actually writing on the bin. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna try to write it really cute. So let's see. So I have finished organizing my two shelves that I'm going to use for like, you know, personal care and like products. And then my other shelves is like towels and stuff mm. and like hair tools and cleaning supplies. So you're not going to see those shelves, mm. but the two shelves that I did organize, they are done for now um, because when I do get more products, I'm going to have to find a way to reorganize it and things like that. So yeah. Um... Anything that you don't see here is because I probably use it regularly. So it's actually over on my counter, like deodorant and the lotion that I actually use and some face stuff. So, yeah. So let's get into it. Okay. So at the top here, we have like miscellaneous hair stuff that is just like too much for them to have all individual bins, like too many different products. So I just put everything in here. Next, this is hair removal. So I have like Nair in here, um, electric shaver, um, shaving gel, all that is in there. Then in here, I have all of my hair products. So it's like, I got like some hair mask in here, some conditioners in there, um, um, a shampoo, anything that um, I use pretty regularly, but I don't need right away for the shower because anything that I use in the shower, I have over there by my shower. So there's that. Next, here are my favorite things. You have all of um, my face care products that I don't use all the time, 24 seven. So they're not over by the sink, but I do use them at least once a week. So we have this Neutrogena um, Clear Pore Extringent. Um, Witch hazel, some pads, I need to get some more of those. Um, mint face mask. Um, this new um, scrub that I'm, I got. Um, we have this um, Aztec mask. Um, and I also have some turmeric and honey for like a DIY mask back there. Then right here in the scrub bin, I have all of my body scrubs. So I have this um, champagne charcoal scrub that a company sent me. I have um, this tree hut almond and honey scrub. I have um, this... Um, soap and Glory breakfast scrub that I really like has oat sugar and shea in it and then I have my favorite scrub is the um, Dove exfoliating body body polish so I have that I probably should put that on top since it's my favorite Okay, so then I have my tube scrubs. So I have this champagne apple honey scrub from Bath and Body Works. I have this soft soap coconut butter scrub. And then I have this um, organics um, scrub and wash coconut coffee. So there's that. Next in the wash bin, which is the biggest because I love wash, um, we have all my Bath and Body Works ones. So we have this Gingham um, Shea and Vitamin E Shower Gel. We have the Rose one. We have the Cactus Blossom one. And then my favorite, which is the Wild um, Strawberry. Um, Next, in the back here, we have this Tree Hut Shea Moisturizing Body Wash in Hawaiian. I don't know how to pronounce that, but 
It's a very tropical scent, very nice. Then I have this um, Rin Pure Lavender and Honey Body Wash. I have another Rin Pure Body Wash. This one's um, the this pink one. It's the vanilla one. Then I have some more um, soft soap washes that aren't really scrubs. These aren't scrubs. Well, this is kind of, I think this has like pomegranates, but it's not a scrub, like they don't exfoliate. So this is the juicy pomegranate and mango one. Then we have the citrus splash back there. I might have to slide this out a little bit so I can get to the back. <laughs> we have this caress um, wash. This smells like, I don't know, like a church lady to me. Like, I don't really like this one. I got it though because I wanted to try it out, but I don't really use that one because it's kind of strong and it smells like a church lady. So, then I have my favorite body wash. This is the St. Ives Soothing Oatmeal and Shea Butter Body Wash. I have the Dove Purely Pampering Shea Butter and Warm Vanilla one. I have this St. Ives one, this Radiant Skin. Oh, this is, this one's actually exfoliating too, but it's not as exfoliating as um, my other scrubs, but. This is also St. Ives in pink lemon um, and mandarin orange. And then I have this. Um, this is also one of my favorites. Like the St. Ives and this one are my two favorite body washes. Um, this is the Pure Castile Dr. Bronner's um, soap, mint soap. So, yes, those are all of my washes. So, next in this little bin, I just put my soaps in here. So, actually, I have a um, couple of soaps. I need to put it in here. Okay. I just have my soaps in there. Um, and then that's a skincare system that I have yet to open. But, um, this is a bubble bath by, um, Soap and Glory back there too. So that's, this is like bubble bath and soap. Then right here, these don't have a bin because number one, I ran out of bins. But number two, it's only like three products. So um, this is um, my Bodycology body cream in sparkling cranberry. Bodycology um, fragrance mist in pink vanilla, which smells so good. And then this is the Bath and Body Works champagne apple honey fragrance mist that matches with the body scrub. So... Yeah, y'all, that is my um, pamper shelf. I hope you guys liked the little tour I just gave you. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, if you knew, if you like videos like this, go ahead and like this video up. And also, if you're new to my channel, go ahead and hit the, hit the subscribe button. Hit the notification button so that you can be a part of the notification squad because the area I'm is on the come up. And we're taking a week to one video at a time. As remember, don't stress. Stay blessed. Bye.